Roy's wife. <laughs> That's why I'm here, to set the record straight. See, everybody's got me pegged as mean and a henpeck or something fierce, especially hilarious. Is the time where I refused to get on the ark? Well, let me tell you, that weren't funny at all. There's a few things you don't know about all that. Why'd you think Noel wanted me on so bad on that ark? Love? <laughs> now that's funny. That man never loved me. No, Siri, he wanted me on the ark because I was going to be the one to look after all them animals. I was the one going to clean their shit, feed their mouths, tend their litters, and nurse their sick. What? What? You think Noah was going to do it? Oh, no, no, no. Difference of opinion, disturbance, dissension, dispute, disorder, disruption, disintegration. Oh, gentlemen, ladies, please, please, let us see if there is not some way of reaching an agreement. I hereby appoint myself your peacemaker in order to promote harmony among you. Uh, my uh, daughter and son-in-law are at odds. Uh, what sort of odds? Tell me more so that I can even them out. Uh, monsieur, uh, briefly, please. Uh, all right, keep your bonnet on. Oh, do you know the origin of the word bonnet? No. It comes from the Latin words, bonus est, meaning it is good. Why is it good, you ask? I was just going to. A bonnet is good because it keeps away catar and bronchitis. Oh, good God, I didn't know that. The cause of the quarrel, please. Uh, well, here's what happened. I know that you will not wish to detain me unnecessarily, since I beg you not to. I have urgent business in town. Hello. More trembling, more twittering, more trouble, more turbulence, more tumult. Now what's the matter? It's get a man, get a night's sleep? It's nothing, doctor. Everything's at peace. Everyone's at peace. Oh, with reference to that word peace, would you like me to read you a chapter of Aristotle? in which he proves that all the parts of the universe can only coexist when there is peace between them. This is a long chapter. Yeah, only 80 or 90 pages. <laughs> oh, good Lord. Thanks, you. We won't keep you up. Uh, some other night, Doctor. You don't want to hear it? No. Oh, then I wish you good night. Or in Latin, Berlinox. And the rest of us can go out for dinner. <laughs> feel so, for brightness is nothing, it is in the heart where values lie. Wait for me, Mr. White Robert! I am coming to... How funny that would be, but oh, I do see the bottom, yes? I see the bottom and I shall hit the bottom very hard and oh, how it will hurt. That's who. <laughs> you won me. Farewell, Leroy. Nice talking to you. I'll say hi to the judge for you. Molly, Molly, uh, come here. We gotta call and warn the judge. We gotta call Charlie. Gotta make sure he didn't get to him. He's my biggest buyer. I'm sure he wouldn't stop buying my cattle because of this little thing. Molly, what are you doing? I'm going to be on Oprah. <laughs> 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 Give me that with her mother. Oh, no! He found with me the champagne water in my possession, and it nearly broke my heart to throw it away. But the law is the law. So I seated myself in the kitchen, having pulled the curtains down, and decided to put temptation out of me forever. I pulled the cork from the bottle, and it exploded like dynamite. I turned it upside down in the sink. Except for a small bit, which I put into a small wine glass, and I drank. Then I pulled the cork from another 
bottle, it exploded like dynamite, and turned it upside down in the sink. All of its contents, except for a small wine glass, which I drank. <laughs>